So what is going on everyone, I'm in a boss with you here, welcome to my channel. So in this video I'm going to be showing you how to copy and paste into a VNC console. So for example, I already have one opened up here. So if I can try uh, going to maybe Wikipedia, copying some text there, coming back to uh, this VNC console. So if I try pasting, there is nothing there, but if I try typing, I have a lot of typing going on there, so uh, so we're gonna have to go to this website here. You can also buy the Windows license key from these guys here. If uh, your license key takes long to come, you can just go ahead and WhatsApp them, and they will send it to you right into your WhatsApp. So uh, going back to the topic of our video here, we're gonna have to go to the collection. I'm gonna have to I'll link the the website in the description. I'll put the link in the description. So simply just go to the collections tab here and we're gonna have to go to the files section here. Uh, so you're going to have to look for the scripts installation file and scroll down to the Win Python here. Okay, first of all, you're gonna have to go to the CMD. So you can simply either go to the start menu here or you can go to the search tab here and type in cmd you are going to run it as administrator and uh, our second step is going to be you're going to have to type in python okay python so if you already don't have if you don't have python in your uh, in your operating system you're going to have to download it so i'm going to have to reinstall it freshly for you guys Okay, as we wait for it to download. Okay, so the installation is uh, the download and the installation is done. So we're uh, you can find these apps in your app list. So it is successfully installed. So if I type in Python again, so I already uh, I have Python installed now, so we can simply launch it. Okay. Okay, so next we are gonna have to install the pip install py auto GUI. I think I'm gonna have to just copy this. I don't have to type it, type it again. Okay, so you're going to have to uh, right click to paste and then press enter. Okay, it's also going to uh, install the same way it has installed the, the Python, but now for this case, it already has a Python installed. So it's using the Python software to install this. So let's also wait for it to finish downloading. Okay, okay, okay. So everything looks fine and uh, we've uh, successfully installed the Pi Auto GRI. So next you're going to have to still go to this website here, go back to collections. So we're going to have to download the software that is going to allow us to run what we need to do. So go back to files. Yeah, go back to files. And uh, you're going to have to look for software downloads. Okay, go ahead and uh, go for the human typing simulation here. Yeah, you're going to have to go for the human typing simulation. You're, gonna just, you're just going to download it. 
Okay, yeah, it's going to drop it up in your download section. So if you can open the download section, so it's here. So you you can extract what you've downloaded. So you have extracted mine already to the desktop. So I already have mine extracted to the desktop here. Here, so you can go ahead and uh, okay, you can go ahead and open it. Okay, so for example, now we wanted to, we wanted to like uh, paste into here, but we couldn't. But now this is what we're going to be using. So you can uh, just come here. Uh, let's first copy what we are going to be pasting. So right click, copy. Okay, come into our come into our folder here. Uh, here we go. Uh, it's going to be our main. Yeah, we're gonna, let me just be precise. Okay, we're gonna just launch the main here. Okay, it's gonna tell us uh, how much time we want to, we need before switching to the editor. I'm gonna put like three seconds. Okay, and press okay, and then uh, go here. So it's gonna start pasting exactly what I copied in the Wikipedia. Very good. So, if you have a code that you want to pass, for example, let me uh, let me collect some uh, some code that I would love to run here. Go into my uh... okay. For example, I want to maybe open pots. Okay. So, for example, I want to run this uh, this code here. So I'm gonna copy, so I can delete this. I can just press enter, it's not going to bring anything. So you realize that uh, I I've, I copy this, when I copy this, it does not work, copy, paste. I don't have any option of pasting. So when I come to my, my software here, just double click. So I want you to take like maybe uh, five seconds uh, before it starts typing. Okay, press OK and go to where you want it to be pasting. There you go. There you go. There you go, Vibers. And I can press Enter and you can see. So that's how you can copy and paste without uh, maybe installing anything uh, from your VPS. So if you're also interested in uh, using it permanently, it might help you in other projects. So you can just go ahead and uh, save it. You're gonna have to maybe take it into, uh, I'm gonna take it into my Windows file uh, program. You can just control V or you can right click and paste. Yeah, continue. Wait, no, 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 no. I put it here, but I cut. You can literally uh, just paste it here. Yes. Okay. Here, here it is. So you can just right click on the main, and uh, you're gonna have to right click on the main. You are going to create a shortcut. You're gonna have to maybe send it to the desktop. Yeah, you're gonna have to send it to the desktop and you have a shortcut and you can easily run this anytime that you want. Okay, so if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and if you have any questions, you can drop them in the comment section down below. I appreciate you subscribing to my channel and I'll see you guys in the next video.